This video is to show you guys what I do to keep the cabbage moths out of my grow area. They're the yellow and white butterflies you see all over the place. In the spring and fall, they lay their eggs on the buds and you know the rest. You don't want them, obviously. And I know you guys spray neem and BT and all that, but I don't want to spray anything on my plants. I don't care if they're veg, whatever. Don't spray your plants, guys. Anyway, this is 30% shade cloth, the black stuff. And it keeps out 30% of the light. It's supposed to last a few years, five years, if you remove it after every grow season. So I enclosed my whole grow in it. This piece was a single... 30 foot by 20 foot and it was about 80 bucks and I'll go in there in a minute and show you how you know you can just kind of rig it up if you don't have a fence like I do you can just go all the way to the ground with it make a framework out of four by fours but it's July 12th right now the plants are going into their stretch and you do not want cabbage butterflies on there. This lower stuff is tool netting, T-U-L-L-E. It's a fabric. It's not as durable. I used some, I used it last year over the whole grow and it's just not durable enough, especially with the wind out here. I'm in Southern California. And anyhow, the shade cloth is the way to go. I'm going to do another video about my growing technique, I pull the plants out to the side. These are all from tree, uh, I'm sorry, from seeds. They're not trees like some videos, but I don't want trees. So this is the shade cloth. You buy it un, unfinished, they call it. It's cheaper. If it's finished, they hem around the edge and put brass grommets, but you can buy these plastic grommets and put them wherever you want. So anyway, this whole thing was hundred bucks about 110 bucks delivered with the these black grommets so anyway i just wanted to show you how to keep the moths out of your grow without you know don't spray crap on your plants guys all right i'm going to put another video up of how i how i grow the plants